welcome to another edition of Samsung Galaxy S7 S7 Edge Tips and Tricks brought to you by HollywoodFrodo.com. I'm Eric and today we're going to talk about themes. Uh, one of the cool things that uh, Samsung did in the S7 and S7 Edge, I think they actually started this with the S6, is building in the ability to apply themes. Maybe you've watched some of my videos and you're thinking to yourself, your phone looks totally different than mine, uh, your settings looks different, the colors are different. Uh, the icons are different, um, the background, all these little icons, it's all different. Different colors, different styles, mine is not like that. And that's because of themes. Now I do have themes up here in my quick settings, but you probably don't. So let's go to where themes can be found. And it can be found under personal. Uh, that's the title on my phone. It may be slightly different on your phone. Different carriers title these slightly differently. Uh, but it'll be a synonym and it'll be similar. Just look for themes and there's themes right there. So we're going to click themes and when you click themes you see all the themes that I have downloaded and you'll see the one I have applied is the blue metallic theme and uh, then they have recommended themes and there are free ones and there are paid ones. So uh, you can buy them but all, everyone I have all of these are ones I downloaded and they're all free. If you want to get more, you just click that more themes button. It'll take you to the theme store where you can check out all these different themes that they have. You can buy one that fits you and your personality. If you open up uh, a theme, you can see examples of what it looks like. So this is a pink theme. If there's anyone out there who's a big fan of, of neon pink, then you can get your pink theme going. Uh, once you have downloaded them and you want to change the look, you just select the one you want to change to and you click apply. And so it's going to apply that theme. It takes a couple of minutes. Now one thing that this does do, you'll need to know, it will change your wallpaper. Uh, so I always, after I apply a theme, I go back and change my wallpaper to the live wallpaper that I want. Um, so here we go. So here's my home theme here and you see it changed my wallpaper so I would go in and change that back but if you drag down you'll see the colors have changed like a lavender looks like background which is not what I would choose with the orange yellow color over it um, and then if you go into the settings you'll see how that's changed and see all the icons are different um, it doesn't have the line separation. See on this one, you don't you don't see through and see the background like you did on the other theme. So it's just a different theme. I'm going to go into themes again, and let's apply a different one. Let's try let's try this one. Click apply, and it applies the theme anywhere it can. And it's just a way to give your phone a personal look that you like, something that uh, is cool to you. Um, I like it. I think it's a great uh, option. Okay, you can see this one has pure black theme, so there's no color on the uh, uh, home screen. And then you see this is kind of cool. It's just a, a, it's a darker theme and then has the uh, brighter blue. And uh, that's kind of cool. So it has different color uh, icons there. And that's kind of cool. You can see each section has its own color. So these are blue. Phone section is orange. Personalization is, uh, I guess that's a different tone of orange, yellowish orange. And then system is green. So it has these different uh, uh, colors that it has. So yeah, anyway, that's how it works. And basically it allows you to theme. Now you might be uh, looking at this and saying, well, how come your home screen didn't change? It's because I'm not using the uh, built-in Samsung home screen launcher. If you are, then those themes will be applied to that as well. Um, I'm not using that. I'm using a third-party uh, uh, launcher by Nokia, uh, which you can re you can see if you watch my Android app reviews, you'll see about this launcher. I, I like this launcher. It's my favorite launcher. But uh, the uh, Samsung one, uh, if you're using the default Samsung one, that theme will be applied to your home screen as well. But anyway, that's uh, how you do it. That's how you change themes. Very easy. Like I said, you can buy themes, but there's a lot of cool free ones as well uh, to change up the look of your phone to make it uh, the way you want it to be. 
Anyway, that's it for this tip and trick video. Be sure you subscribe to the channel so you can keep up with future uh, tips and tricks as well as accessory uh, reviews for the S7 and S7 Edge. Check out my product review playlist for all kinds of electronics and gadgets and household appliances and smartphone and tablet accessories. Check out my Android app review playlist to find out about cool apps such as the home launcher I'm using. This is called Z Launcher, by the way. Um, but uh, you can check out all, all kinds of cool apps to make your phone better in my Android app review playlist. And if you really want to take it to the next level with automation on your phone, then check out my Tasker 101 tutorials. Anyway, that's it. Until next time, have fun with your Samsung Galaxy S7.